This presentation is about the literary awards for children's books. Did you know that every year authors and illustrators are nominated for the work that they have done? In the following slides, you will be introduced to six of the awards that can be earned, although there are many more to be had. The Newbery Medal originally was awarded in 1922. It was the very first children's book award in the entire world. The medal is bronze and depicts John Newbery, an 18th century English bookseller with two children on the front. On the back, inscribed are the author's name and the date that the medal was awarded. The medal was awarded to authors who could demonstrate original creative work in the field of books for children. Some of the titles that received this award are Bridge to Terabithia, Joyful Noise, a Poem for Two Voices, Mrs. Frisbee and the Rats of Nim, Bud, Not Buddy, and the one and only Ivan. The Caldecott Medal is awarded to the illustrator who has the most distinguished artwork in a children's book that year. The illustrator must be an American citizen. This medal was first awarded in 1938. And the image on the front of the medal is from Mr. Caldecott's book, The Diverting Story of John Gilpin. And it shows John Gilpin astride a runaway horse, accompanied by squawking geese, braying dogs, and startled onlookers. It shows the action. In children's books, the illustrations are as important as the words that are read. The recipients of this award are chosen by the Association for Library Services to Children, much like the Newbery Medal. Some of the recipients that have of this award are Beagle, the Unimaginary Friend in 2015, the Invention of Hugo Cabaret in 2008, Snowflake Bentley, 1999, Polar Express, 1986, and Where the Wild Things Are in 1964. So when you're searching the library and you come across a book with the Caldecott Medal on the front, open up the book and take a look at the illustrations and notice how they serve the story and promote the plot. The California Young Readers Medal is a program that was established in 1974 and it celebrates recreational literature for children. The way an author is nominated is by young people. That means that you could even participate in this every year by telling your librarian and voting for the titles that you enjoy reading the most. They have to have been written within the last four years. Here are some of the award winners that you might recognize. The Day the Crayons Quit! Exclamation mark. Press here. I need my monster. We are in a book. The Coretta Scott King Book Award celebrates authors and illustrators of African American descent. The very first book that received this award 
was a book about Martin Luther King Jr., a man of peace. Very appropriate. The seal which appears on the recipient's books is that of an African-American child reading a book. There is a symbol of a dove, and the words surrounding it in the circle say peace, nonviolent social change, and brotherhood, all ideals that the kings stood for. Some of the award winners are March, Book Three, Brown Girl Dreaming, Slam, Mufaro's Beautiful Daughters, and Roll of Thunder, Hear My Cry. These award winners were first nominated by a special group, a committee, the Coretta Scott King Book Award Committee. The Geisel Medal, named for the author of Dr. Seuss books, is awarded to authors and illustrators of children's books for beginning and early readers. It was established in 2004 and first presented in 2006, so that makes it a very new award. Some of the most recent books that have been awarded this medal are We Are Growing, Good Night Owl, Oops, Pounce, Quick, Run, Go, Auto, Go, and The Infamous Ratzos. Anyone could nominate a book, but there is a committee that will decide which one will receive this award. The Orbis Pictus Award was first established in 1989, and it is an award for the best nonfiction children's book. The name Orbis Pictus comes from a book called Orbis Pictus, The World. It was a book written in 1657 and considered the very first book actually written with children in mind. Anyone can nominate a book, but there is a committee that actually selects the award winners. Some of the more recent books to have received this award are Some Writer, a book about E.B. White, Drowned City, Hurricane Katrina in New Orleans, The Family Romanoff, Murder, Rebellion, and the Fall of Russia, a Splash of Red, The Life of Horace Pippin, and Monsieur Marco, The Actor Without Words. So when you're checking out your nonfiction books, look to see if this award is on the front of that book. <laughs> 